welcome back or welcome to my channel if you are new please subscribe i post on wednesdays and saturdays at 6 p.m great british time um and please push that notification bell i do post occasional bonus videos but that is quite rare so thank you very much if you've already su subscribed or if you subscribe today i appreciate each and every one of you that watches my videos and subscribes to my channel so thank you very much in today's video i'm going to be sharing with you two quick and easy diys to make with your essential oils uh, if you've followed me for a long time or know me personally you know that i'm really into essential oils and i believe a lot believe a lot about essential oils and use them very like near enough all the time so i have researched a bit on these i'm going to just do two quick and easy ones today um, and if they go well then we'll make some more in the future so first of all i'm going to make the scented bath salts and secondly i'm going to be making bath suvers so for these you will need so for the first one you'll need and salt which I just took from my mum's so I've got a bowl here and I'll tell you the measurements as we go through it um, you need baking soda or for the UK we've got bicarbonate of soda and then you need the essential oils you'd like to use so for me I'm probably going to be using lavender and rose but I may change it along the way I'm not sure and the second one you need is just your essential oils whichever ones you would like so again, I'll probably be using like the rosemaries and the lavenders, um, peppermint possibly. And then for that, all you need is silicone muffin uh, cases, which these are actually mini cupcakes, cupcake cases, but they'll work. I've just got this small baking tray just because I'm going to put them in the f to cool down and that, well not cool down, but to set, I'm going to put them in the fridge. So I've just put it on that. And you'll need bicarbon you'll need bicarbonate of soda and you will also need um, some water for the epsom salts one the first one i've also got like a mason jar here so that is all you'll need i've just got two bowls clear bowls to mix it in and i've got two spoons as well so let's begin with the first one so for the scented bath salts you need one cup of epsom salt i got all of these in asda last year well, actually it could have been the year before um but you can get these anywhere obviously uk we don't really measure in cups but obviously us and other places do but you can get these in uk too so this is a one cup of epsom salts so that's that and you will also need 10 drops of essential oil so I'm just going to put it in here and then I'm going to use um, this is I've just got this from Amazon but it's the essential oil in lavender and I'm also going to put rose in there because that's very good for me um, and I'm just it says to put about 10 to 15 drops in so this is what I'm going to do now And I'm doing it more lavender than rose. Oh, just got the table. And I'm just going to mix this in slightly so it all blends. And then that's it. You just get your mason jar. If you're doing this for a gift, you'd put like purple ribbon around it and put a bit of lavender in it, real lavender like sticking out. But for me, because it's just for me, I'm going to pour this into my jar. Oh. And then, obviously, I haven't made a full jar, but if you obviously wanted to, you could make more. Um, but that is ready to go um, I think it'd also be quite cool to layer it up with different colours but that is your first one and then we're going to move on to the bath suvers 
So put that to one side. So I've got my baking tray and my silicone cup cases. These were five pounds from Marks and Spencers. And I can't get them out. And I'm just gonna put them out on my baking tray. Okay, I don't think I'll fill it all, but that's what we've got so far. So what I'm going to do is in my bowl, so move this to one side for a minute. In my bowl, I'm going to mix together half a cup of baking soda, which is bicarbonate of soda, and half a cup of water until it forms into like a putty. So this is my half cup. I'm gonna go fill, the, fill my half cup up with water and be back for my bicarbonate of soda. So into my bowl goes the water. And then I'm going to fill the this up again. And then I'm going to mix that in with the water till it forms a paste. So now to to that I'm going to add in again I'm going to add in peppermint rose and lavender and it says about 10 to 15 drops so five of each really Okay, so I'm just gonna mix this all in so you can see it's forming now really thick, which is what you want. Okay, so now I'm gonna bring in the baking tray again and I'm just gonna pour in a bit of this in each one. So I filled six and these ones are spare, but if you were to do more for presents, especially Christmas and that, then this is ideal. So you can keep these ones spare for then or make some cakes. <laughs> so I'm gonna put these aside for 30 minutes now and then they will be ready to pop out of the cases. So these have dried now for just over half an hour and you're just gonna literally take them out of the cases. broke like that then I'm just gonna wash up the tray and everything like that and these are ready to go um, and I can't wait to put them in the well put one in the bath later and that's it for today's video if you liked it please give it a big thumbs up please comment down below if you uh, love or like essential oils and if so have you made any DIYs uh, if you have what would be one you'd recommend me to make please also subscribe push the notification bell to see when I post and thanks for watching bye